So good afternoon to everyone. Being the first presenter before I commence the presentation proper, please allow me to thank the International Association of Scientists and Researchers and all association to take part for this very timely, exciting, and commendable research conference. To begin with, may I present to you my research paper entitled The State of the Art of the Province of Marin Luque on Prime Scene Investigation by yours truly, Jason L. Monteagudo from Philippines Marindoque State College Institute of Governance and Public Affairs. Introduction, scene of the crime operation only happened after a call for a span or a request and or need to process the crime scene. The purpose of crime scene investigation is to help establish what happened or crime scene reconstruction and to identify the responsible person. The Philippines gets a bad rep for criminal cases, partly because they take ages to solve the crimes committed. According to Police Director Arturo G. Kapdak Jr., the Director for Investigation and Detective Management, that in the past, it has been commonly observed that several lapses in crime scene investigation procedures have been committed such that despite a strong case filed by our police officers, some cases were eventually dismissed, hence, the study was conducted to establish challenges encountered with the crime scene investigators in the course of their investigations. General objectives. The study generally seeks to establish the challenges encountered by the crime scene investigators in the course of their investigations in the province of Marinduque. For the specific objective, it is specifically it plans to show the socio-statistic profile of the respondents as for age, gender, educational attainment, rank, unit, and years in service, established methods is used in collecting of evidence, identify current mode of transporting evidence, analyze the nature of the storage of evidence, and evaluate the relationship between the investigator's level of training and his or, or his or her level of success in criminal investigation. For the conceptual framework, this research was basically conceptualized to examine and explain the factors interpreted as independent variables that affects crime scene investigation. Those factors are being encountered as challenges from the lack of or poor of collection methods used, improper travel and storage of evidence, and the lack of or inadequate training for the crime scene investigators. On the investigation process, there is an intervening variables except except the above-mentioned independent variables, which influence the outcomes of the investigation. This includes legal foundation, continuing support, and high-profile influence. Legal foundation may interfere the investigation if they don't follow the legal framework or procedures. Continuing support may also influence if the local government or the agency and or itself may not give its support needed by the personnel or operatives. Lastly, the high-profile like politicians, Juridical persons and businessmen and corporation may influence the investigator if they will pressure to give him to give a certain favor. Methods research design. This study used quantitative descriptive research method by employing survey questionnaire. A survey questionnaire will be utilized to decide the statistic profile of the respondents and challenges, which includes collection methods, traveling, and storage of evidence. Participants, there are 60 respondents composed of 46 police investigators in investigation and intelligence section, eight scene of the crime operatives, and six crime investigation and detection group in the province of Rainduque. Sampling procedure. The collection of data was done through the administration of validated survey questionnaire to the selected respondents the request letter was sent to each of the municipal chief of police to gather pertinent data. For the data analysis, data was analyzed by using the statistical package of social science, version 26. What inferential and descriptive type of statistic was employed? And the variant analysis was done to get means, frequency, tables, pie chart, and percentage. Results and discussion. Crime scene investigators of the province of Marinduque faced with a number of challenges, which includes lack of modern equipment, facility for the travel of evidence, rescheduling, canceled, prolonged court hearings, resulting to contamination of evidences. 
unequipped storage facility. Distance between the storage facility and the laboratory and the lack of regular pressure training course or program in which it may affect in their operation or performance in scene of the crime investigation. Increase of the crime rate, poor deterrence, and acquittal of the accused. Recommendation. Review the standard operating procedure, PNP manuals, and trainings in the processing of crime scene and propose and attend rigid refresher or new training course in order to address the gaps encountered and highlighted in this study. Problems faced by the investigators must be addressed to the PNP higher authority so that appropriate solutions, strategy, and action plan can be made by the organization. Also, the PNP should follow the national standard that requires the need in investigating a crime scene to address the problems in collection, traveling, and storage of evidence. Next, factors affecting their performance can be analyzed by the future researcher. In addition to the recommendation for the future researcher and to have a further study into the demographic sociological characteristics of criminals from the crime scene. For the last slide, these are the references. And this is the end of my presentation. Thank you for listening.